All right, Red Raiders get their season underway on Tuesday night as Chris Beard's team hosts Incarnate Word Cardinals in a tale of two halves of the ball game tonight. Red Raiders led by nine at the break, but it was all Texas Tech after that, Chris, a dominating final 20 minutes. 48-7 in the second half in favor of uh, <laughs> Texas Tech. You know, and, and you go to the locker room, you've turned the ball over 11 times, you finish the game with just 14 turnovers, so just di did everything. We saw, we saw the block shots come in waves as the Red Raiders finished with 11 block shots on the night, and, and balance is very hard to guard, and you saw you know, guys like you know Matt Mooney and Brandon Francis, Jarrett Culver, all and, and Davide Moretti all start to score a little bit for this basketball team, but it was really all defense. Uh, and, and just, you know, uh, incarnate words, inability to, to knock down shots right there as they shot 10% in the second half. I'm not sure if I've seen that much. They make three of 30 shots in the second half of this ball game. Jarrett Culver leads the way for the Red Raiders in this one, and we'll talk about him a lot over the course of this season, clearly. But the sophomore from right here at Lubbock Coronado High School, Really, when this team finally needed to get going, he's the guy with the spark. Yeah, he, you know, this, uh, as you mentioned, a bit of a slow start, but uh, you see him in transition. You see him uh, scoring, uh, knocking down uh, shots from deep right there, finishing at the rim, and just so smooth because 16 points, but doesn't really work that hard for it. It just comes so naturally. He's just gifted. Very, very talented young man. Brandon Francis was in double figures, and then a couple of the new faces, Matt Mooney and Kyler Edwards, also in double figures. Yeah, and, and, and some guys that are going to have to provide some scoring for this basketball team, and they'll lean on some of these guys that, uh, that, that weren't asked to do that last year, but Moretti and Francis, a couple of those. Overall impressions because a big crowd to watch this ball game and here statistically not great to start, but it's going to wind up looking pretty good as they, they really do dominate this game. Yeah, and I think the 29 turnovers is something that's a bit of a calling card as you turn uh, Incarnate Word over uh, 29 times, which leads to 36 points for you. But you're right, statistically not, not much is going to jump out. And I think Chris Beard will take that first half as a, as a coaching point and, and say, fellas, we need to be much more like the second half team. And uh, but you're turning right around uh, on Friday night with another game. Red Raiders are back in action on Friday night when Mississippi Valley State visits. First three games of the season are right here at home. And you talk about the defensive effort. Tariq uh, Owens, big part of that. I mean, inside, it's, it's the kind of guy the Red Raiders haven't had. Certainly a rim protector, and our Matt Mika caught up with Tariq after the game. Tariq, a dominant second half, only allowing seven points. What were you able to do defensively to clamp down on their offense? Um, we went in at halftime. Coach, coach gave us the keys and the tips that we weren't executing in the first half, keeping them on the side, uh, being aggressive, and that's what we did in the second half. We just came out more aggressive and played our style of play. Thanks. Congrats. Thank All right. You. Their style of play, great defense. I mean, Chris Beard says, as far as this team can go this season, all about the defensive end. Yeah, I, I think on defense and, and, and communication, and they'll commit to that side defense that Mark Adams, one of the assistant coaches, teaches and preaches, and that, that team last year bought into that. And then your work on the glass. They weren't just wonderful on the glass tonight. I think just a plus five advantage for Texas Tech, but, but defense and rebounding will carry this team a long way this season as they try to figure out who they are. Those two things will certainly be prevalent all season long. Well, third season for Chris Beard as the Red Raiders head coach. He's won all three seasons openers. The Red Raiders off and running after an 87-37 win over Incarnate Word back in action on Friday night when Mississippi Valley State visits the United Supermarkets Arena. For Chris Level, I'm John Harris. So long, everybody.